It's a little scrap hounds. We're down at a uh, nice little spot here. I'm gonna spend the afternoon. I was saying it's uh, my Auntie Carrie's birthday. So here we came out to the river. Nice little spot. I haven't been out here for a few years. Big old washout. Yeah, brought some pans. Whoop. It's a beautiful spot. There's my mom and my auntie Carrie. That uh, train bridge, if you go onto that center section there, there's uh, a rope, like a bear swing. We're swinging out into and jumping out into the river. We'll try and go across. I don't know how deep the river is. It never used to be much more than about knee deep. But we'll check that out. Yeah. The seashells. I was already down here. Check this out. They're not seashells, sorry. They're oyster shells. Clam shells. Got a whole bunch of them here. I'm gonna just drop the pan. Some big chunks of coal. It's pretty cool. Yeah. Like the coal that's everywhere down here to pick some up, gather up some of these shells. So my mom, she likes to clean the shells up. You clean this back side off and then you get the nice uh, shiny side, kind of like the inside, but it's on the outside as well. Yeah. Yeah, you can see the coal, it's just everywhere. Nice flat piece. More shells in here. That's a nice one. Still held together. Nothing like rubbing your feet in the sand, in the water. Neat all this like, uh, I don't know if it's a shale. It looks like that red shale. Yeah, it might be a good place to find the, the nicer driftwood. That's what I had just said to your mom. I said, Dad, there is a nice pit. We're walking on this river. Okay. <laughs> Sandstone. <laughs> <Just>, uh... <laughs> this piece of driftwood, funky. This little one. Funky. Yeah. Well, that's a keeper for sure. Yeah. 
Should have brought the pans over here. I left them sitting back over there. Oh. Oh yeah, that ain't coming out. That is not. Oh, this nice piece of This one we pulled right out of the water here. Clamshell. House right there. I'd love to live right there. Man. one worth washing up sometimes you find even just the littlest ones but they can be so cool looking so I guess today we went from scrap hounds to rock hounds let's go rock hound and scrap hounds nose to the ground there's lots of these piles, <clears throat> the rocks just up here on shore. Kind of like this guy here, that's pretty cool. It's like a pumicey looking stuff. And another one here. And maybe stuff like this, I take it home and I wash it up, scrub them out nice, get all the dirt and whatnot. Maybe uh, something like this goes into the giveaway. Kind of a cool one, it's iridescent. Yeah, I'll pick some of these and definitely be taking some home to clean up and yeah. Some of that might make for a cool part of the giveaway for you guys getting me to 500 awesome subscribers. This guy's pretty cool. Yeah, some of the, <clears throat> some of the shells I picked already. Some driftwood that my mom and my aunt Carrie picked. I might not get to use the pans for panning. And it's cool, just these huge hunks of coal. You know? You guys are probably curious to be up and close to that bridge, too. I am. You know, you could cut it and get, mm -hmm. this is really cool. Yeah. Hmm. What are we here? This looks like a cool one. Oh, I'm just, looks like 
that'll wash off. That's definitely going to come home. Mm -hmm. Check this out. Woo! Yeah, a little bit of echo. That's all wood timber. And it is still functional. Well, there's some steel, but uh, going over the river, it's steel. But yeah, check that out. This is all wooden beams. and work the would have went into that hey pretty cool pretty cool and yeah it goes into the steel structure over the river or they probably replaced it from over the years. And then way on the other side, try to zoom, it goes back into the wooden, wooden timbers. Yeah, well, it doesn't really look like it's gonna be too friendly for my mom and my aunt Carrie to get down there. And I could trudge along through it, but I know they're not gonna want to, unfortunately. One more gander at this side of the bridge. We'll go back down to the river. That is some slick mud, slick mud. Oh, broken bottle. We'll be taking that out of here. That's not good. Don't need that winding up in the rivers. Definitely something to be careful of the old bare feet. Check out this bug. See if it'll move. Pretty weird. I don't even know what it is. Have you ever seen these kinds of bugs by rivers? You know what it is? Let me know in the comments below. They don't want to take their shoes off and get in the water. <laughs> Just coal everywhere. You guys see anything crazy shiny? Like a big old diamond or something. 
<laughs> nugget of gold. Let me know, I'll go back and get it. You can definitely tell she gets uh, deep right off the sandbar. Coming through that little chute there. Bit of a breeze picking up. For as shallow as this is, it's got quite a little current. I think it's only knee deep on my feet. <laughs> a nice little dip. This probably had been a good place to bring the pans over to. We got them full of rocks already though. Let's see if we can scavenge well, that's pretty cool interesting stuff yeah here we are on that little island. This river is also really good uh, in this area. Well, most of this river is really good for fishing. What do they got in here? Jackfish, walleye, there's uh, rainbow trout, uh, tiger trout, I think they're called. There's quite a few uh, Arctic grayling, oddly enough, has been caught in the Pemina River, actually in this area. Ooh, that's some slick mud, slick mud. That's kind of cool. Just the way that clamshell's half buried, kind of like the dinosaurs when it all went down. <laughs> Woo! That is some gooey, gooey mud. <laughs> and it's slick. Oh, it stepped on something sharp. Not sharp, but like a stick. Yeah, that's kind of cool. Some bugs crawling around under the water. Whoop, slip sliding in that stuff. Yeesh. Yeah, getting back up over to the bridge here. Under the steel section. Big rock down in there, piece of driftwood on it. But it starts to dip pretty good here. <laughs> Whoa. Huh. Hopefully we don't sink out of sight over here. Old wood timbering. Yeah, that's really nice down there. Try to walk around here. It's crazy, all the trees washed up here, come down the river. Fishing in these holes in here. Uh, early in the year can usually be pretty good. There's uh, always fish stuck up in them.
This is like a Badlands. Makes me want to walk across that, but I bet you he'd sink pretty good. And it looks too cool to go and disturb with foot tracks. There, so we're on the other side of the bridge now. That's just up to the point there and blocked by the trees. Oh, black sand, black sand. I wish I brought the pans. Oh, yeah, look at it. That's beautiful black sand. Heck, yeah. Bong. Watch your head, watch your head. Yeah, we'll see if we can head on a little further down. Then we'll come back and we'll uh, get on that side. <clears throat> and actually, yeah, being down here, it's and bring them to hang out with my auntie Carrie and my mom, even though they're way back there. But it, uh, it's kind of a celebration for the both of theirs birthday because my mom's birthday is coming up on Saturday which could be the day you guys see this video or the day after hard to say I could just set up camp here and like live on this little area <laughs> Watch our foot in here. Big old spiders crawling all over the place. Just a beautiful spot all along the river. The old farmland. Up along that high bank there. <laughs> A gorgeous place to have your farmland. Huh. Thought there was a trail from here that went across onto the back onto the other side, but uh, doesn't appear to be. There's all sorts of thistles and wonderful things to walk through. And I am barefoot. But, uh, guys, I'm going to walk back across here. And uh, we'll see you over at the bridge. So here we are. Back under the bridge. I'm just going to head down over here. Across there. Go across. See how easy it is to climb up here. Yeah, it's pretty dry. There's something really cool about standing by these old bridges and train trestles. Aha, here we go. And the ropes are still there. Too cool. And it's cool they've made 
somewhat stairs in here for getting down here. Some of them look like they've washed away over the years, but <laughs> I know what you guys are thinking, but I'm not wearing clothes to actually get wet in the river. But we might be back before the summer's over for a dip. Or a nice black sands. Yeah, she, like I say, she gets deep here. Great uh, fishing if you just drop your line in around these logs. Awesome for fishing. Oh, hey, check this out. Thought he was a champion. <laughs> Need to like put it up on the end of one of these stumps somewhere. There we go. <laughs> yeah, from over here you, get, you can kind of see where it goes back to the wood timbers. Yeah, pretty cool. Those swings are for another day. Like I say, I've got shorts on, but I got all sorts of stuff in my pockets. And <laughs> I'd love to go for a rip on them. Yeah, I hope you guys are kind of enjoying this little afternoon down at the river. It's been a lot of fun. Uh, let me know in the comments below if you guys think about uh, the rocks and stuff like that. Maybe being part of the giveaway for the 500 subscribers. It'd be awesome. I think that's pretty cool. I always love uh, finding some rocks. So, you know, a little piece of what I'm interested in away from scrapping. And go to one of you guys or a couple of you. Not sure if it'll be a first and second. We'll have to see. But yeah, that might be part of it. Let me know what you think. So yeah, Scrap Hounds, I'm going to love you and I'm going to leave you. It's been a blast. Awesome day down here on the river. Seen some cool stuff. We'll be back for those swings. Smash the thumbs up button. Drop me some comments down below. I love reading the comments. If you're new to the channel and you want to get into the giveaway, Hit the subscribe button, jingle that bell, and wait for the drop about the video. Not sure, it might be a keyword thing. Maybe a, pick a number between one and a million. I don't know yet, I'm not too sure. Mine's going, mine's going. But there'll be a video on it. Cheers! One last pan before we pack her up, scrap hounds. It's been a beautiful day, uh, an afternoon down here at the river. My mom and my auntie Carrie are still over there picking shells. Some last minute finds.